Hi guys, it's Wombat, and by god did I get a lot of questions during the release of my last video, which was the uh, TSM Map Combo Europe Edition, because a lot of you asked why didn't you include Afromap, why didn't you include EAA? Well, it was the European Edition, so what do you expect? <laughs> this, on the other hand, is the Global Edition, which do include Afromap, it do include PJ Indo, Antarctica and EAA, as well as the rest of the maps that we use on the European edition as well. Some of you who have followed me and my map combos for a while might say, what the f did you include EAA, huh? What happened to Canada? Fact is that yes, I used to have Canada on the TSM Global Edition, but I have decided that I from no one will use EAA here instead of Canada. And the reason for that is that I used to have EAA on my Pro Mods Global Edition. The problem with EAA is that it is growing bigger and bigger and bigger. It doesn't really fit together with Pro Mods anymore. You have a few roads, a couple of roads. Um, on pro mods that is overwritten by EAA. So instead of continuing to have that, I decided to move EAA to my TSM setup and then use Canada on my pro mods global edition instead. So here's Canada as well as the Antarctica, PJ Inlo and Afromap and all the map mods you saw on my last setup for TSM, the Europe edition. So, without further ado, let's dive into it and have a look. So we're gonna start with the map, and as always we have TSM. We also have the North map. We have all the five DLCs, of course, and then Ross map going up there and down here. Then we have Southern region. We have the Volga map up here. And then Great Step. We also have Romania extended, as well as YKS Turkey, the rescaled version by Arias. Then we have Sardinia map, as well as Paris Rebuilt. We have Afro map, there you go guys. And PJ Indo, Antarctica mod. And finally, we have the EAA map, which is bonkers big. It's getting bigger for every version. I mean, it's almost overlapping Portugal by now. Um, but at least, it won't interfere with pro mods anymore. So there is the maps we are using today. But of course, I guess most of you have been waiting for this, the uh, map setup. And if we start at the bottom, we there find the Antarctica map, map and depth file, followed by base map for EAA and the map file for EAA as well. Then we have two optional files. It's the power cargo for EAA and heavy cargo for EAA. Both of these are optional and they require the heavy cargo DLC as well as the power cargo mod from SCS. Um, high power, I think it is called. We have the heavy cargo, as I said, and the um, high power cargo pack. Uh, so if you don't have those two, you don't have to or you can't add the heavy and power cargo. We then have PJ Indo, Afromap 2.0, Great Step Map, Model and Def File, followed by Southern Region, Model 3, Model 2, Model 1, Def and map file, 
and above that the fix for TSM and Southern Region and finally Southern Region English City Names file. Now if you do speak or write, read Cyrillic you don't need this file but I don't so I want it in English. You then have Volga Map Model 2, Model 1 and DEF file followed by ROS Map Model 2, Model, Map and DEF file. Now be aware that the map file and def file for Rustmap aren't the original files. It might look like the original files, but it is an update patch unofficial uh, for the Baltics DLC. Now if you don't have these two files, the patched files, not the original ones, the game will crash. Um, so make sure that you download this update, this unofficial update, and then replace the map and def file, the original ones, with these two. We then have realistic Russian highways, followed by no Rusmap police in Europe, which is a fix for Rusmap. Old city names version 1.3 is English city names for the otherwise Cyrillic uh, Rusmap cities. The last Volga map file then goes on top of the old city names. And then we have North map, which I have moved down below TSM after consulting Arias, who recommended that North map is located down below TSM. I haven't had any crashes having North map above TSM, but I trust Arias more than I trust my mother. So um, I moved it <laughs> then we have the tsm file file number um, six prefabs and more followed by file number five four three two and one then we have great poland and a road connection from great poland to tsm as well as a road connection between great poland and ross map then we have the YKS Team EU Turkey map model 2 file and you can't really see that it is the model 2 file unless you look at the information about it and its package names and in model 2. Then we have model 1 as you can see from the package name. And then we have the def file. And we are not going to use the map file instead we are using the YKS RSK 1.5 which replaced the map file. Now in the Europe edition I used version 1.4 that works but obviously there is a version 1.5 so I'm using that one instead this time only to ensure that Arias is happy. Speaking of Arias we then have Romania extended file number 4 3, 2 and 1 and then a few road connections Romania extended to TSM road connection YKS RSK to Romania extended road connection YKS RSK to southern region road connection and finally YKS RSK to TSM road connection and Great Poland to Romania extended road connection that's a lot of road connections and then a few optional files, it's the ferry files, Turkey to Southern Region ferry, as well as the Romania to Southern Region ferry. You don't need to add any of these two, they are optional. And we also have the No Italy to Southern Region ferry, which is a ferry connection from Southern Region to Italy. You add this file if you want to remove that ferry. The reason you can't re can remove it is simply because it doesn't exist in real life. Then we have Romania extended English city names file. Again, if you read Cyrillic, you don't need it. The base file for Sardinia map. I also used the um, prefabs file in my uh, Europe edition for TSM um, video I did a couple of days ago. Apparently you don't need it because Romania Extend includes the prefabs anyway. 
so I've removed it this time. Then we have Paris Rebuilt, Swedish Islands, obviously the Wombat Edition. Thank you, Bengan, again. <laughs> Gotta use the Wombat Edition. And then five different ferry connections for Antarctica mod. All of these are optional. If you don't use any of them, you will still have ferry connections from Italy and Stockholm, I believe. Uh, to Antarctica. So these are all optional. Feel free to use them or not. Uh, it's from the Swedish islands to Antarctica, from Calais to Antarctica, as well as Afromap to Antarctica, YKS Turkey to Antarctica, and finally the EAA to Antarctica ferry connection. But they are optional, as I said, you don't have to use them if you don't want to. But I highly recommend that you use the TSM Big Map setup with background version 1.2 by Doomer Days. That is the background I'm using. If your background looks different, try this one. As well as the Super Zoom by Arias. So that is the entire setup for the Global Edition. So there you have it. One final thing. I am including a profile even this time. It's something that I might continue to do. I am doing it now for the TSM setups just to evaluate it and see what the reaction is. And I've already noticed that if you do not have the Krona DLC, you can't use my profile. So I'm going to go ahead and say uh, that you do not only need the five map DLCs for this combo to work. If you are also using my profile, you need the Krona DLC and possibly a couple of other important DLCs from SCS. If you don't have them and you can't use my profile, that is just bad luck. I, there's nothing I can do about it. There's nothing I will do about it. Use your own profile instead and add maps in like you used to do in the good old days before I started providing you with profiles. Um, and as always, if you're having any problems with crashes, make sure that you have all the map DLCs. Uh, make sure that you are using the same versions that I'm using. Um, make sure that you have replaced the original Rust map map and def file with the um, patched version that I'm also including a link to. Um, make sure that you have everything set up in the correct order and if it still doesn't work remove any other mods you may have on your profile if that doesn't work create a new profile and make sure that works before you then add only the mods that I'm using in this video and when that finally works go ahead knock yourself out and add whatever other mods you want to add as well so that's it i hope you're gonna enjoy this setup uh, and i want to thank you for watching if you enjoyed the video please give me a thumbs up uh, and if you haven't already done so subscribe as well and feel free to share this video all my videos to your social media so take care everyone and i hope to see you again next time Bye-bye.